team match, and this will be the women's team gold medal match. Poland facing Japan. And first half from behind the curtain, the team from Poland. A squad that defeated Germany 5 to 4 and knocked off Georgia in the semifinals by the count of 6 to 2. A fairly young team. Natalia Lesniak, 24 years of age. Karina Lipiarska, 29 years of age. And Violeta Michur, 33 years old. As we meet the team from Poland. Natalia Lesniak, Karina Lipiarska, and Violeta Michur. Get those cameras ready. As Poland gets set to take on the team from Japan. From the land of the rising sun, the Japanese squad, which defeated France six to nothing, and then held off Russia five to one in the semifinals to secure a spot in the gold medal match here today. The trio from Japan, Sugimoto Tomomi, Kawanaka Kaori. This is Sukibayashi Rina. Were you a little bit surprised that it was Poland and Japan who made it to the gold medal match? I was surprised for Poland, but not really for Japan. I, uh, I thought that uh, German will make it through all matches, but Poland uh, surprised them with really good shooting. And uh, now they are here fighting for the gold. Goes to show anything can happen. And no one is to be taken lightly. Sugimoto. The 21 year old ranked 149th in the world with a nine to begin. Now Sugi Bayashi. Okay, okay. 22 years of age. They're both left. And Ms. Kawanaka, the veteran of this trio, ranked 12th in the world. And her first shot lands in the 10 ring. The Japanese are shooting really fast, and that's good because nothing, uh, I mean, nothing wrong can come in mind, mm -hmm. bad thoughts. You don't have time to think. Exactly. Which might be best. <laughs> yes. Eight points. So an eight for Mishur. After the 10 that was posted by Natalia Lesniak. Libyarska, 29 years of age, ranked 26th in the world. Right now she is the only member of the Polish team who has qualified for Rio, at least so far. Slim one point advantage for Japan. Nice Also, okay. Japan has a team quota for Olympics. Sugi Bayashi. And if Kawanaka can come through with a 10, which she does. She is a really strong archer. That puts a lot of pressure on the other team. Yeah. 
they need <laughs> perfect shot. The minions are here. I mean, perfect yeah. score, sorry. Yeah. And they start good. Two more of those, and they'll split the set. We will let him be sure. Nine. There's still a possibility of a time, depending on where that third Polish arrow lies with respect to the scoring. Still some question about one of the shots by the Polish team. So perhaps all is not lost yet. Let's see what Karina Lipiarska can offer up. Nice. And the young woman who had a team bronze medal in Nîmes in 2014. Shoots a nine, so that's 55 points for the Polish team. And Japan should take this first set, take a two nothing lead in their quest for the gold medal. <laughs> so Japan jumping out to a 2 nothing advantage here in the Congressium in Ankara, Turkey. Kawanaka with great focus, great concentration. She is one archer that I've watched, Anna, who does seem to really enjoy herself. I mean, we saw the concentration there, but she seems to have a good time out there. Yes, she's enjoying and still she's enough focus to, to keep uh, shooting really, really, really strong. I would imagine that's not an easy thing to do. No, it's not. <laughs> to be loose and relaxed and focused all at the same time. But those who can do it find success. Exactly. It's uh, it makes easier to come on the top. Because in the end, on practice, we, we are never serious. We enjoy our work. And if uh, an archer can copy this uh, on competition, is definitely a winner. That's a good point, carrying it over from practice to what you're doing here in this kind of a situation. Try to stay relaxed and stay loose. Lesniak, 24 years of age. Nine. Won a team bronze medal at the Indoor World Championships in Nîmes 2014 and in Ogden, Utah in 2009. Back Natalia, when she was a teenager. Yeah, Natalia also surprised uh, last year in European Field Championship where she won a silver medal. I think it was uh, her first competition for Hunter Field Arrowhead. Lipiarska, whose parents were both archers. Raised in the sport. Now Japan has a chance to make a set with good shots. And 9-8-9 by Poland, leaving the door open for the Japanese team. Trying to secure the gold medal here at the Indoor World Championships. And right now, they are in good shape. <laughs> Ten by Kawanaka would provide a ten, or excuse me, a four-point lead. No, oh. in fact, okay, 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 okay. what do you think happened okay, there? Okay, okay. Maybe too much pressure for her, because she knows that uh, she needs only mm -hmm. a yellow. <laughs> Sometimes this only makes makes it harder. You're always surprised, and when I say you, I mean all archers are always surprised when it's a shot that goes into the eight ring, the seven ring. It always seems to come as a shock. 
Yes. Are you surprised when that happens? Maybe when you when you do wrong shot and you know it's not for ten, you hope it will be finish in nine, nine. ring, uh -huh. but <laughs> you just didn't do the right the right shot. Do you know immediately what was wrong with the shot? It depends uh, where are you. Maybe on finals you don't uh, you don't know. Mm -hmm. Because uh, it, you can feel uh, pressure, and in Secure. pressure Secure. like Secure. our finals uh, medal okay. matches, it's uh, not easy to know directly. Right, to analyze that yeah. moment, what happened. Exactly. And it's good uh, if you want to know that the uh, nice coach nice maybe nice tell you the, the direction to keep uh, Doing great shot. Kawanaka being called upon once again. They need a 10 to tie this setup. Split the points and she delivers exactly what they needed. <laughs> An impressive display by Kawanaka. In a clutch situation. I think when you when you don't shoot a 10 or 9, it's good to keep your focus on things that works for you, you know. You, you keep thinking about what, uh, about something that gives you 10s and not about uh, what did I do uh, to shoot uh, eight or seven? You know. Think about the positive things. Exactly. What it's works? Really important. What works for Anna Umer? For me, it works uh, exactly what I told you. It's uh, to to focus on things that are working for me. Such and, as. Uh, our Keep uh, relax and uh, for my technique, uh, for example, this competition I was focused on my left hand to to keep going uh, and uh, finish a strong shot. And uh, it's important when you when you are in stress to accept yourself and uh, improve with uh, doing a great uh, job not to mess because you are not perfect. Every archer has uh, different uh, feelings about competition. Nice shot. Lesniak. Trying to start a comeback for the Polish team, which trails for nothing. Be sure with a nine just inside the line. And a lot riding on the shoulders of Karina Lipiarska. Lipiarska answers. <laughs> the Polish team hasn't missed that much. They haven't been that far off, but the Japanese team has been very accurate, very precise. You talked about being relaxed and not feeling pressure and watching them between the sets. They each grabbed a bottle of water, laughed, had a good time with each other. Of course, I suppose it's easier to laugh when you, you have a 4 nothing lead. Yes, but uh, in Sessi, Sam, you, you need to fight till the end. Yeah, 
and Japan definitely fighting, only trailing by one in this set. They're hoping to close it out in three straight sets, and Poland trying to keep this match going. They've got to win this set to do that. Ten. Yes, they still have a chance. So Lesniak, 24-year-old. Trying to pave the way now for Violetta Michur, who debuted in her career at the World Championships in New York City back in 2003. Biarska averaging just nine, under 8.8 .8 points, points per arrow. So a nine right there. And the Polish team in a bit of trouble right now in jeopardy, depending upon what the Japanese team does. Sugimoto with the 10. Yeah, nice Sugi Bayashi nice with another 10. Nine will get the job done. Ms. Kawanaka, who was on the team that won a bronze medal in London at the Games of 2012, yeah, and she wraps it up. There it is, it's all over at 10, more than enough for the team from Japan to claim gold here at the Indoor World Championships in Ankara, Turkey. Oh, look, she's crying. <laughs> she's so happy. They did a really good job. You have to hold your emotions in for so long and you finally get to let it out. Exactly. And they won straight 6-0. Yeah, 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 yeah.